spaceship. <laughs> Holy <laughs> is dead. Holy. It's a spaceship, Mike. I know it is. No way. It's not a spaceship. <laughs> Holy <laughs> is dead. Holy <laughs> guys, I'm zoomed in. It's a spaceship. What is this a close encounter of the fifth kind? The spaceship. This time, even the experts aren't sure. What I saw on the film looked a lot like what many people have described. And copies of this videotape began to circulate among UFO enthusiasts. It begins with a birthday party, obviously shot on home video. But then, the party takes a strange turn. A power outage and a flash of light caused the men to investigate an apparent plane crash on the other side of the hill. It's a spaceship, Mike. I know it is. It's no way. It's not a spaceship. Holy is dead. Holy guys, I'm zoomed in. It's a spaceship. Moments later, the UFO's occupants emerge. Holy Don't look at us. Get the for 60 terrifying minutes, the panic-stricken family fights off the invading alien. The home video ends abruptly as the aliens enter the family's home and apparently abduct them. When I first ran across the tape, I was invited over to a friend's house who said he had a very interesting UFO abduction tape. Tom Dongo is a top UFO researcher and author based in Sedona, Arizona. He believed the tape was genuine. I was stunned, shocked by what I saw. I felt that the tape might be real because it, it fit in very well with so many uh, UFO alien incidences that I know of. It, it fit very well, in fact, almost too well. I thought no one could fake something like that. After spending three months checking with UFO researchers worldwide, Dongo was unable to find anyone else who had seen the video and he was unable to locate another copy. It began to seem even more obvious to me that possibly it was an entirely authentic video and someone, uh, namely possibly the government, was trying to uh, grab all the copies uh, that were out there. I have been studying UFOs for 42 years and I've got a pretty good track record. Retired U.S. Army Colonel Don Ware spent his career working closely with military intelligence. I thought that it did not have the appearance of being a scripted production because everybody was talking at the same time and you couldn't understand half of what they said. They gotta come through the house to find him, okay? But when that gives us five more minutes... The people on camera did express a great deal of emotion. If they were actors, they ought to get an Oscar or an Emmy. Perhaps the most controversial aspect of the video was the appearance of the aliens. I have not seen a real alien, so I don't presume to know what a real alien looks like. What I saw on film looked a lot like what many people have described to me that they have seen on board alien vehicles. In the one sequence where uh, I believe it's uh, Jason that's, that's carrying the supposedly dead alien in, I took photographs of each uh, frame. And in one frame, the eye of the alien is sunken in. When I was at the International UFO Congress, there was a man standing over my shoulder as I was going through these prints, and he said, I have seen dead aliens, and that's exactly what happens. When they're dead, their eye gets concave like that. It's clear that people will believe what they want to believe. Ultimately, you have to decide for yourself. <laughs>